In this video, Rog and myself will be thrown into three different locations. All that we'll be able to do in these locations is buy from shops, skill, or pick up spawns. With each location, we also get a random number of GP to spend in that area. Who will come up with the best strategy to win the final fight? Let's find out. A massive thank you to Raycon for sponsoring today's video. B's and G's, Raycons come at half the price of other premium earbuds. They offer six hours of playtime along with seamless Bluetooth connectivity, and they're really shaking up the audio game. With every order, you get a case of these little rubber earbuds that go on the end of the Raycons, and they go from extra small all the way to extra large, and it means you're going to find a size that fits you perfectly so they're not going to fall out. And you guys have been loving it when I do the shake test, so here we go again. They are not falling out. Celebrities like Rich the Kid and Snoop Dogg absolutely swear by them, and they come with a 45-day money-back guarantee. So if you're not satisfied with them, you get your money straight back. I've recently been doing a lot of running and walking, and these have been amazing. I just pop my phone in my pocket, chuck on the Bluetooth, and with the little buttons on each side, you can control whether you want the volume to go up, you want the next song, you want it to pause, you want it to repeat. It's brilliant. It's got these own like sort of like mechanics you can press, um, and depending on how many times you press or how long you hold the little buttons which are just there, um, it does a different action, which is pretty cool. So if you're looking for some wireless earbuds and you're thinking, I might as well give it a punt, you'll get 15% off by using my link in the description. And remember, you get your money back in 45 days if you're not satisfied. So go to buyraycon.com slash linksocarina and you'll be helping out the channel as well. Hello Bs and Gs, welcome back to the channel. Uh, just a quick note, I'm moving on Friday. I move into my house on Friday, um, and so I won't have any like internet or a setup. You know, I've got to furnish the whole like stream room and stuff. So we didn't want to start the mini series and then I have to do all of that and there'd be like a break in between. So this is just like a fun one-off solo PvP that's coming out. It's nothing to do with the uh, the mini series. It's just some content for you guys to enjoy. Um, super, super simple. Um, you guys would have got that intro and I'm sure uh, you know exactly what's going on. So you know what? We're going to jump straight into it. I want to find out where I'm going first. We've got three of these locations. This is going to be our first one. Please be a decent one. Ooh. Relica slash the lighthouse. We'll take that. And let's find out how much money we're going to get to use in Relica slash the lighthouse. <laughs> Ooh. That is the big time. So guys. Area one of three is Relica slash the lighthouse. I have 200k to spend and 15 minutes in the area. Every area is 15 minutes. Let's get into this. I'm really hyped for that. Okay, B's and G's, 15 minutes on the clock. 200k, Relica and the lighthouse is what we have. I'm starting in the lighthouse just because I'm going to grab myself a book um, and then we're going to run over to Relica because there's actually a few good things to buy. So, here... We go, starting the clock, let's grab the rewards, and let's grab a unholy book, and let's trade with Jostic. And I'm going to grab myself just some tools, just in case we like run into anything in the next areas where I'm like, I wish I'd bought some tools. We'll grab a rope as well, cool. Um, and I'm going to run over to Relica now, because, uh, you know, there's the helm shop, there's the warhammer shop, there's all sorts of good stuff over there. I'm actually really happy with this for a starting point. Uh, the reason I went for the Unholy book over, like, the balance or something is just because this gives attack bonus in everything. Um, so, like, if we get a really good area and, like, there's a, you know, a crossbow or something like that that I think, actually, I should probably go for that, um, you know, then I've got mage, range, melee, all um, covered. So that's why we went for that one. Hey, everyone, and welcome to today's PvP challenge. The PvP challenge where we have three different regions, three different amounts of money, and 15 minutes in each region to get the best setup very interesting concept let's see where we get thrown first we need some good rng this is going to be very very rng based and we have to spin the region first and then the money i know i can get swordfish from the legends guilds i can obviously buy ranging gear from the ranging guilds i think it only goes up to studded if you want the green d hide you actually have to play the mini game and 15 minutes is definitely not enough time to get that done so let's see how much money we're gonna have in this challenge uh please be a lot i want rune arrows 45k 
Okay, that seems to be like the middle ground-ish area. You know, this is gonna be a really interesting challenge because even though we do have a time limit, time really isn't going to be too much a factor, at least not in all cases. Um, but yeah, so let's start that timer and just see the best way we can spend our money. So we do have 45k and we can bring all objects to our next region aside from the money. So we do have to spend all the money because we will not get it back. That part cannot be transferred over. I really wish I could have gotten the ranging cape. Forgot that was here. So that's really annoying. I didn't get any of the higher ones. Um, we're of course going to buy studded. We're going to buy the leather van braces. The coif or quaff, I think is the actual way to pronounce that. And oh god. Let me actually check here first. This is just the ticket merchant. I guess I could try... To get this stuff, I mean, that I, I, I just don't think it's possible. I just don't think it's possible. I know we could already buy rune arrows and stuff, but I don't actually want to spend all my money just yet because you also have to go to the Legends Guild and buy our food there, which is actually a pretty good um, little upgrade. I can only get a willow here. Just going to pick some flax as well. We can pick up spawns. We can use things like that. So I'm just going to take a couple flaxes with me. It might be possible that we... Uh, we do something pretty cool later on. I don't know. Yes, harpoon. Nice. So we're going to get ourselves a harpoon. Hit the helmet shop. Oh, no. Is there just none in stock? Oh, there's none in stock. Oh, man. Okay, well, we're going to get an Addy Warhammer instead then. And a Berserker helm. Oh, no. I thought we were going to get a rune. <laughs> That's annoying. Okay. But you know what? Not a bad, bad setup at all. Then we're going to trade with Yersa, I think. Um, and I'm going to buy all of these things. They all give stats and definitely worth it. We're going to have so much money left over because, uh, yeah, I thought we were going to get a rune at Warhammer. We are going to get ourselves some shark slash swordfish and then I'll go ahead and cook them. And I realized I just got the, uh, I had the wiki up, which was hiding the timer. But don't worry, guys, it was still going. It was still going. That threw me massively. I really thought I could get a rune uh, Warhammer together. But yeah, so now I'm going to spend the rest of the time getting sharks and... Um, swordfish um and yeah we'll just we'll just probably drop the swordfish and try and get a whole inventory of shark but you know what guys i think that's a really solid start wait am i in the wrong one am i in the wrong one lobster oh i'm an idiot i'm a genuine idiot that i'm i'm really losing it here i'm losing it okay big net that's where you go Oh, sorry to all the team links who are screaming at the screen for the last minute or two. Um, so yeah, I will keep them just in case we don't get enough sharks. Uh, but we will go ahead and cook these um, over in... I think there's a fire in this tent. Okay, that was actually not too bad. We're about to finish the inventory, hopefully with five minutes to go. Uh, there we go. Um, yeah, so we're going to cook these. I will probably drop the swordfish and the tuna because it looks like we'll be able to get a few more sharks together. Um, and I've had a little think about this money. Um, as I was saying earlier with the uh, with the Unholy book, I might as well buy the other helms as well, just so that we can, like, you know, if we do go range, then we have the Archer's Helm, etc, etc. Um, and I might as well spend the money because it doesn't carry over or anything. Uh, looks like we're cooking quite well here. If we could burn none of them, that would be amazing. Um, so, yeah, I think I'll buy just the, the, the Mage Helm and the Range Helm as well, uh, just so we've got them. And there is our first Burnt Shark. Come on, just one burn and I'll be pretty happy. Oh my god, this is... No. Oh no. What boat do they have here? Hold on, do they sell a maple here? Or you? Oh, this is bad. This is... God... <laughs> This is not good. Okay, you know what, guys? We're going to go to the Legends Guild real quick, and I can go there without wasting any time. I didn't realize this was going to be this difficult, or maybe it really just is as easy as buying a Willow Shortbow, but let's uh, quickly snap our fingers and end up in the Legends Guild. So we're hopping worlds, buying Swordfish. I also bought an Attack Potion. Of course, all this stuff is off limits. It's just this top four items here uh, because that's what the shop sells. I am going to buy 28 Swordfish, so I'm going to buy two more. And we also did get an attack potion just in case. I'm not going to bother buying steel arrows here because I could buy better arrows at the um, ranging guild. Although then again, I think the best arrow I could only use is mithril with willow. Siegfried, we're going to buy a cape of legends. Um, I mean, this stuff is useless to me. I mean, I know I'm getting a left half. Myth seeds. 
kind of pointless. So we have 38k that we kind of have to spend in the ranging guild because this is all there is to spend money on in the legends. So um, let's head back to the ranging guild and find the best way to spend this money. This is the only other shop we didn't look at. These are really bad. They give like 36 range strength and have a three second attack speed. So I know some people might be thinking going for it. The spec on them is atrocious. It, it hits multiple targets. And of course, I'm only fighting one target. So we are going to have to spend all of our money on like a willow short bow. Oh my God, I can't believe I'm doing this. A willow short bow and I guess mithril arrows. So we ended up just buying 250 myth arrows, 40 rune, 40 addy, just in case I find a way to upgrade my bow. Probably won't. Dude, there is no way I'm getting 2,400 in this time. There's, there's, there's literally no way. Nice. Very, very nice. And we'll do the swordfish and the tuna as well. Again, I'm hoping we can drop the swordfish and the tuna, but... I would rather go in to the fight with, you know, a tuner than an inventory space left free. So uh, we are holding on to it for now. This flax I might also drop if we manage to get these sharks pretty quickly. Um, just because I don't know how useful this is really going to be, to be honest. And the one bad thing about this area is that there's no bank. So I'm not able to actually, like, you know, put the flax in the bank and then use it at a different area. Um, so that's what this area is a little bit bad for and it means that I have to sort of play ultimate Iron Man for this whole uh, this whole time right now. So as I say, we are going to just drop them but if we don't finish it off in time then I will come back and pick it up. And I'll make sure to pick it up as it's about to despawn so it gets another two minutes etc. Because uh, I really don't want to lose this food but uh, we might be able to get all the sharks in three minutes. Okay, I've kept one flax, we don't need two, that was ridiculous. Um, and instead of all those inventory slots being used there... Um, I've gone ahead and picked up the swordfish, so we've still got them. We've got three more sharks to cook, but we do also need two inventory slots for the helms. So uh, if we burn one of these, then we can get a helm, but I hope we don't. I'd rather drop a tuna um, and maybe the rope as well. <sighs> Bastard. Okay, we'll drop that and you know what? I think I'm going to drop the rope. I can't see why I'd be using that. Um, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, and we're going to buy the two other helms. I think we can afford the two helms. Let's have a quick a quick check. Um, the Farseer helm. Oh, maybe we can't. Archer's helm? How much is it? 78k? Oh my god. Okay, yeah. I probably would have preferred to go for the Archer's helm if I didn't... There's a Rune Warhammer in there now? I know you're seeing the wiki, but I've got to check this. Okay, no. People are selling it to the shop. They're selling it to the shop. Okay, I was about to say. Can we get a shark and we'll cook it in the next area? Come on. Okay, it didn't happen. But I think that's a solid start, guys. This money doesn't carry over. So that will get wiped and we'll get a new amount in the next area. Let's go on to number two or three. Also, Bees and Gs, can we hit 4k likes on this video? I'd be over the moon. And smash that subscribe and bell button if you haven't already, guys, so you get notified about all the videos. All right, guys, let's see where the second place we're going to be going is. <sighs> Come on. I have six and a half minutes. I can't do anything else, though. I spent my last GP on nine more rune arrows, ten more addy arrows, because, of course, we can't take any of the GP with us to the next region. So, if anything, we could just drop this because... We're not going to need it. Let's get up the spinner again, guys. First, we have to spin which region we're going to. Let's get like a big landmass here. No more guilds. Zaya, that is massive. That is freaking awesome. Okay, how much money do we have to spend? And we could also get a magic short bow, I'm pretty sure. So 100k, literally say less, guys. Let's go run over to Zaya and start that timer. I literally just got done saying time wouldn't be that much of an issue, but I think when it comes to Zaya, it might be. This thing is fucking massive, this landmass. Look how damn big this is. I decided to start at this port over here, one of the entrances to Zaya, because it's closer for my plan. I spent about five minutes thinking, how do I get an axe on Zaya? And then I remember there's the freaking woodcutting guild that literally has an axe shop, so ignore me on that one. Thankfully, that wasn't recorded with me trying to figure that out. But long story short, we're going to buy an axe, create create ourselves a uh, magic short bow. So I'm really, really glad I did buy some rune arrows. Obviously, I wish I bought more now, but I didn't know I was going to get handed Zaya. Then we're going to buy some sharks, and then we're going to try to run to the magic shop and buy some runes after that. We have 100k. 
So by the end of this Zaya chunk, wow, look, I have chunk in my vocabulary now. At the end of this Zaya round, I'll call it, we should have an upgraded weapon and some barrage runes, which will be really nice. So let's start that timer. Let's get run on first. Start that timer and start running along. Let's go to the woodcutting guild. Yeah, this is going to be hard with having no run because I'm already out of run and I don't even have my axe yet. Perry. Hand me, oh, which one do I buy? I don't want to go incredibly cheap. Uh, let's not even, well, why am I ever thinking this? Just buy a myth axe, so it's not incredibly slow, but we don't waste really any money. And uh, let's go to the magic trees up here. We only need one log, and then we're going to run to the general store, snag ourselves a knife. I had no idea people really still cut magics. I guess they're just super chill and the most AFK thing before you get to Redwoods. That's my only guess. But uh, we might be here for a sec. Maybe I should... Oh, no. Just kidding. I was just about to say, maybe I should have gotten an, an Addy or a Rune because we have so much money. But glad I did it now. Ooh, that's a good one. Oh, we could upgrade our weapon. We could upgrade our weapon. We could get a good cape. Um, is there any skilling we could do there? I don't know. But that's a really, really good one. Um, we need the GP, though. If we don't get the GP... Then it's not good. Let's see what we are going to get. Come on. At least 50k or something like that, please. Oh, my God. <laughs> Come on. Oh, the RNG is in my favor today. All right, guys. To be honest, I'm just going to go ahead and start the timer straight away. Um, I had a little look. Unfortunately, we don't have an axe, so we can't get the... The magic tree, because we could have then fletched that into a short bow and possibly made a, uh, a magic short bow, which would have been pretty cool. Um, there's the runite rocks downstairs, but I don't have a pickaxe. Um, so this would have been really good if I'd had some tools. I mean, I'm not saying it's not good. This is It's still a really, really good chunk. Uh, let's just bank quickly. But it is going to be a case of literally just using one shop, and, and then I'm going to be done. Um, you know, that's the territory that comes with a challenge like this. You might not be able to do anything but buy. Um, but I'm not going to lie, it's a, uh, unfortunately it would have been great if we could have afforded these, but they are just too expensive, it would have been really nice to have had a shield, uh, but we do have this weapon shop available to us. Now, I think the maces got buffed quite recently, didn't they, so that might be the way, we're definitely getting a dragon dagger, although the mace has a good spec on it now as well. Let me have a little think of this. As I say, I've got 13 minutes and this is literally all I'm going to be doing. I think uh, we will be buying the Myths Cape actually. So let's do that because I know I'm definitely going to be buying that. That's going to cost us 10k and is a big, big upgrade. Really, really happy with that. Um, and yeah, I just need to really think about where I want to go with the weapons here. Yeah, guys, it's going to be the mace. It's, it's now 4 tick. So it's as quick as a scimitar and it's spec. Its spec is insane. If we uh, if we equip this, 25% it uses, and it increases damage by 50% and accuracy by 25%, and it rolls off his crush defense. It's the same spec amount as the DDS, but the actual weapons are just like the the stats are through the roof. A 74 crush attack bonus. It's just going to be so much more accurate, and I think this is the way to go. Guys, I, I'm going to have a little run round and see if I can do anything. But unfortunately, just as I say, don't have a pickaxe, don't have an axe. Would have been so, so nice to be able to. I know the herbal shop um, sells Eye of Newts and stuff, but there's no way we're going to be able to get like a, a guam together. What? Hold on, you have to sell a knife here. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I think I'm just mistaken. Okay, I knew... I was able to get a knife here. I almost panicked. I almost panicked. Let's craft this real quick. We need our flax now. Pick up one flax, and I think we just have to swing this way. We got to go... I think it's up here or something. Hold on. I've done this before. Where... Oh, right here. Oh, fuck. That's such a long walk. All right. Let's put the flax on the spinning wheel. Let's spin this and we can get our magic short bow. There we go, guys. Looking absolutely amazing. Probably one of the best ranged weapons you can get. I'm assuming this will be a very low defense fight. So you can even make the argument this is better than a rune crossbow. But then again, you know, he could have gotten like myth skills with 200k. And my guy just went on a shopping spree or something. So... All right, we have to make some room. I want to sell it to a shop. We have to make some room. Um, 
Well, oh, because there's people buying it out. Okay, oh, this could be bad. Uh, let's go to 2K Plus Worlds. Let's hope we can get some raw sharks. I don't know what the stock amount is, if I'm being honest, but we're about to find out. I doubt 2K Plus. Oh, 25? Okay, um, actually, let's... Oh, this is going to be a sin, but we have to just drop those. I mean, we do not... Is that a bank deposit? No, it's a cooking chest. What the heck is that? Cooling chest? I don't think we'll have enough time to restock on the sharks if we burn any. Oh my gosh, why do I jinx myself? Okay, well, we do have four minutes, so it's going to be a case of do I refill more on food? We have the swordfish to replace any missing sharks for another... But I think magic is just going to be that crucial, guys. I, I really do think magic will be crucial. Plus, if we do bring magic, we can afford a few empty spots on the food because we're going to need the runes, of course, and maybe some switches. But oh, this is bad. I'm going to stop recording this before I keep jinxing myself. You know what? We'll buy it just in case, just in case something crazy happens. I will go ahead and I'll buy a Eye of Newt and a vial of water as well. We'll get a pestle and water. Um... Yeah, downstairs there's some blue dragon scales, but that's for anti-fire. We're not going to need anti-fire, I don't think. Um, but yeah, I'll have a little look, but I don't think it's going to happen. And of course, we can't actually attack anything because it's shops and spawns only. Um, so I can't go ahead and start attacking the dragons and stuff, which uh, could have been a bit useful. But yeah, guys, I don't think there's going to be anything else here for me. You know what? I was slightly mistaken. There is a raw tuna spawn down here, um, and we can just cook it straight on the fire here. So what I'm going to do with the last few minutes is just hot worlds. Um, and yeah, just use them like nine minutes here. Um, unfortunately, they are aggressive, these uh, these ogresses. So I do have to go around the corner. I can't just be hopping uh, constantly. But yeah, and we'll just get a little bit of food together because obviously we didn't get ourselves um, a full inventory of sharks. So might as well get some food in case we don't get any in the next area. Uh, so yeah. That's it, really. All right, guys, there we go. Got way more food than we need now. We got those sharks we had earlier, and we've got the uh, swordfish as well. So we are good to go. Um, yeah, I've been super lucky with those first two. I'm not going to lie. I'm not expecting a good one on the third, but you never know. Do you? you never know. So let's get this up. All right, here we go. Oh, my God. <laughs> Wow, my RNG has been insane, so I could choose any option I want on the wheel. So, looking at what we've currently got, I'd say my food situation isn't too bad at all. Um, I'd say it's okay. I'd say where we're lacking is actual, like, you know, armor now. We look so bare, like, if he comes in with anything decent, like a, like a mace or something, he is going to tear through me. So, we should probably pick an area... That uh, that's going to give us some armor. I think that's probably going to be the best way to do it. So, what's going to be the best option for that? And I think if I was live streaming right now, everyone would be like, take the risk. Take the risk. So, guys, I think we are going to choose the uh, Caridian Desert. So, we get the whole of the desert. And let me get the uh, GP spinner up. If this is like 15k, we're in big trouble. Big, big trouble. So, here we go. Or make your own money. Oh, that would be awful. <sighs> Come on, get in. That's going to be enough. That has to be enough. Only burnt four. So that's five open spots we have. You figure three for runes. It might not be too bad. And someone's actually buying runes too. Someone's doing what I'm doing. Is Link doing a PvP challenge? We have 10 seconds. Come on. Hop, 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 hop. Come on. Come on, we're just gonna fucking buy- Oh, no, we're out. Okay, no, I'm an idiot. There we go. Guys, let's stop that timer. Very weird how I kind of spent my money on runes. Um, the other shop, this shop over here sold the death rune. So I basically just bought 150, 50 per world hop, came over here, hopped a few times. I only need one soul rune per blood spell. So we only got 20 of those. And I just bought 200 water runes and put the rest into blood runes. So I very, very weird ratios here. But um, yeah, I'm probably going to do mostly ice barraging. Arg, I thought he was saying my name for a second, dude. Chill. <laughs> Let's see where we are going next. Come on. Another really good one. This could decide everything. Mortania? Oh, God. Okay. Well, how much, how much do I have? How much do I have to spend there? Oh, I mean, could could it <laughs> could it be any worse? I guess I could have gotten the 15k. I I, I actually had to think about this for a second because I don't know where I spend that money. I already have sharks. I could probably top off on the missing sharks I have, but other than that, I don't 
really know where I'll spend that. So obviously I can't do it now, but I didn't have enough time to come over here and buy a staff because I was frantically buying runes and I wanted to make sure the runes were at least kinda averaged out appropriately for the spells I want to cast, but we missed out on a staff of water, which would have been really crucial. I have no idea what I'm going to do. I've been thinking for the past 10 minutes trying to piece together some sort of solid plan. With only 25k, it's pretty hard. Of course, I'm going to top off on sharks. That's the first thing I'm going to do. I dropped my axe, unfortunately. Um, I don't know if they sell one there, but I could uh, still cook right here. It's fine. I could enter there without any ecto tokens, so I can still cook my sharks. But aside from that, there's nothing I can do. I thought about buying the... Um, the Evandis Flail, but it's 40k. I can't even get it for 25k. So I do not think I can do anything else in this region that could benefit me for the final fight. There's no way to get more arrows. There's no way to get mage gear. There's no way to get more runes without doing combat, of course. That's easily enough. I've been so lucky. I've been so lucky. Oh my god, I feel for Kins. I feel for Kins. Although he could have been doing better than me. Actually, I don't feel for him. He's probably doing better than me. That's sick. Okay, B's and G's. The last area that I have, and actually I think I'm going to have to use all the time here. I've got a little plan. I don't know if it's going to work or not. It's a bit of new content that I haven't really done. But I think we might have the possibility of doing something pretty cool. Um, we've got a bank right here. So I'm going to start the timer. 15 minutes. And we're going to bank all of this. Now I am a little bit short. I know I was happy with 100k and I'm not complaining because 100k is huge. But if we'd had just a little bit more money, I think about 7k, we would have been able to get full rune from the shop here or at least a rune chain. Uh, but we can't afford the rune plate legs and that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to buy the rune chain body, the green dehyde chaps and the green dehyde van braces. Um, which then puts us looking pretty, pretty tanky, I would say. That looks awesome. I'm going to drop these for the inventory space. And boom, I think we're looking pretty solid there, actually. Actually, really solid. I'm well happy with this. Um, but what we're going to go ahead and do is we're going to run over... Oof, I'm going to have to go up, aren't I? Oh, no, we can go over there. Um, and we're going to go down to here. Oh, is it lobsters only? Oh, I thought I was going to be able to catch sharks. Let's see. Let's see um, whether that's going to work or not. If not, I might just play a game of Tempros. Oh dear, and we're taking damage now. Yeah, anyway. Uh, <laughs> so we're going to go over there. I will check out this fishing spot just quickly. Um, but it does look like it's going to be just lobsters, unfortunately. Um, and we don't have a lobster pop. So that would have, you know, we wouldn't have been able to go from there anyway, so... I'm a bit worried I'm going to die to the desert heat, actually, guys. So I'm, I'm not even going to bother. I'm not even going to bother. It says lobster. It doesn't say shark. I, I really thought it was shark there, but it obviously isn't. So we're just going to go with Tempros, and I'm going to try and get myself a couple KC. Then we'll open up some crates and see if we get some, like, food or something. Um, I think you can buy a shanty pass on the door. Um, and we've obviously got the money for that. So I think we should be good to get in here. If not, this plan is completely gone. And Tempros is fine because it's only skilling XP you get from this. And me and Kin said, we're good. We're good as long as you're skilling, that's fine. You just can't uh, get any combat XP. So we are able to get it. Um, so let's get on the boat. As I say, I've only played once. So I really don't understand this game that well. But I'm sure I can get one or two KC in uh, 11 minutes. So we'll uh, we'll see if we can get anything decent from the crates. So I know we sort of harpoon here. Then we like cook them on the range here or something. And some clouds fly around. Honestly, if you haven't done Tempros before, it's it's very odd. It is very odd. Um, in terms of shops, this place is atrocious. So not too happy about it because I feel like this this whole region's kind of wasted for me. Um, even though I'm like five sharks short of having a full inventory, only about two is going to help me because of the runes in my inventory. I came here to buy insulated boots and remembered that a Slayer Staff is a thing. That whole staff mishap. Of course, we can't get a benefit on the water rune aspect of it, but I'm not gonna buy anything else. I don't need it for Slayer Dart. What's the magic attack on this thing? 12, it's better! Is it worth the extra inventory spot if I can go back in time? Um, I don't know, but I'm pretty excited. Hell yeah, man. 
okay, let's go cook these sharks. And then that's going to be the episode for me because I just can't burn like two of them. That'd be really embarrassing if I did. And it looks like we're going to have no issue at all cooking the rest of those sharks. I'm going to give one last scan because <laughs> I, I feel guilty leaving 10 minutes on the clock. But there's nothing in here I could do. And it would take like four minutes to walk there too, but there's just nothing I can do with what I have. And we have a staff now, which was a very pleasant surprise. Here's the final setup, guys. We have just a one-way switch between a magic short bow and a slayer staff. With the slayer staff on, we have a plus five magic attack bonus. If he has no magic defensive armor or if he has rune on or something, I think I'm going to hit him just fine in this. If he does have studded, for example, I think it's going to be a lot more difficult to hit because like me, for example, I'm wearing studded and I have 33 magic defense. But if I take this off, I do go to plus 14, which I think will be good enough to hit that sort of 33 defense uh, when it comes to magic. So it's going to be a case by case basis. I might keep it on. I might take it off when I mage. Maybe I won't even find myself maging too much. Maybe he's going strictly magic and I'm just thinking, OK, let's just put the arrows into him and not worry about it. So we have to make up our mind when we are fighting him. Now, in terms of the runes, I decided not to bring soul runes because I just don't think blood barrage is worth it. I sacrifice an extra shark. And I think Blood Barrage in the gear that I have is going to be much less DPS than the Magic Shortbow. So if anything, I hope to Magic Shortbow him and then he takes off his armor and then I throw in a few Barrages or something to, you know, keep him away from me. And then maybe a few heals, but I don't want to have to rely on Blood Blitz or Blood Barrage to win the fight. Not in this gear, guys. Hopefully he doesn't have that good of a gear and my Magic Shortbow just rips through him with Rune Arrows. That's kind of the goal. So... We'll see you in the fight, guys, and hopefully we come out victorious. It's not just me on my own here, is it? I don't see anyone else in the game. I legit see nobody else, guys. I see no one. This ca I can't be just doing this on my own. We're in a Tempros world. Oh, no. Does everyone just do it in the American world? Guys, I'm just going to hop. I'm just going to take I'm just gonna take it and just hop because I don't think I'll get a solo Tempros <laughs> <laughs> oh that oh yeah everyone does it in the american world okay all right oh that's a little waste of time but yeah anyway <laughs> we should be okay now right here we go two minutes 50 left so if we do get some raw food uh this would be a perfect amount of time just to be able to cook it all let's see what happens there is the tempros kill two uh casey and I think everyone just goes and forfeit. I'll leave. Uh, everyone seems to be doing it. So, yeah, let's do it. And let's go and get ourselves, like, our net or whatever it is. Two minutes 31 left. Excellent work. Cool. Let's net and see what we get. Can I have a net, please, mate? Give me a net. Take net. Thank you. All right, let's see what we get. <laughs> oh, 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 what's this? Oh, bloody hell, it's all going on. Is there nowhere to cook? Is there nowhere to cook? Oh, mate, you are joking me. You, oh, wait, fire. Oh, thank God, you guys would have crucified me if I didn't work that out. Boom, there we go, guys. Uh, there's not going to be any more time for anything else. So, decent setup, really nice food across the board. I'll show you the setup. So this is going to be the setup, B's and G's. We are going to go with the uh, the sharks, swordfish as well that we got, which was really, really nice. We actually got too many swordfish in the end with the ones that I got from uh, Relica and then the ones we got here at Tempros as well. We got way too much. Um, rocking an 11 prayer bonus. So I think I might keep on piety for uh, for quite a long time and we'll, and we'll sort of gauge if I'll be able to keep it on for the whole fight or not. Yeah. Super happy to be honest, guys. Berserker Helm, Mythical Cape, Dragon Mace, Rune Chain Body, the Unholy Book, Green Dehyde Chaps, and the Fremnik, and the Green Dehyde Bams as well. Which means if he does go magic, we have that 15 magic defense, which that's huge. That's so, so massive to be in the positives there. Over 100 defense in everything else, which is really, really nice to see. And this bad boy with a 74 crush and the spec, I think, is going to be so nice. So let's get into it. Kinos.
Hello, hello. We got a little bit of an old style PvP yeah, today. Mate. The old vibes. Uh, you know, I can feel the old vibe juices flowing today. I won't lie. I won't yeah, lie, for sure, man. Actually, not really, dude. Your knees are out. <laughs> it's kind of throwing me off. <laughs> I got. You know, cover them I'm up. trying to reinvent myself for summer. You know. So, how did you find your time, <laughs> mate? Um. It. So so my plan was pretty straightforward. Um. I guess there's a few things I could have changed about it, but I'm very happy with my gear with what i was given right was what i given good i don't know honestly i did not plan until i saw my region so i didn't do much theory crafting outside of what i could or couldn't or what i couldn't do yeah so i yeah i've, so got, I, I've got an interesting fact, thing got. that i wanted to ask you and i don't know whether you want to do it or not but okay um, do you want to say before we do any reveal the total amount of money you were given? Oh yeah, I gotta add mine up real quick. Hold no on. Uh... We'll be back with you after this short technical break. <laughs> no, no, you don't have to end it. I just had to make sure they were right. You know, yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. no, I, I think I got it. Okay, yeah, no, I got it. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Uh, yeah, but I, yeah. mate, I'll go first because I think I think I got really lucky. <sighs> I think I got really lucky with the oh, money. Fuck. Like, I think I had money left over in every region. <sighs> Shit, you not. Oh, there was one where I couldn't buy something that I wanted, but... You're just flexing at this point. Man. I <laughs> got 500k oh, no. total. 500k! <laughs> My highest cash stack I got was 100k. Here. Wow. All, all three. And there was a 200k around there, wasn't there? Yeah, dude, I spun 200k, 200k, uh, 100k. Oh, spoon fed link. <laughs> Did you have to make your money at all? Or are you all, um. No, they are. <laughs> <Thankfully not. laughs> okay. so, some were impossible, bro. Like, yeah. my first region would have been impossible. I would have just been standing there. <laughs> That's not the old vibes. That's the old vibes of the videos. <laughs> okay, that makes me feel a lot better. I'll let you go in for oh, a, uh, a slot, mate. Now it's just whether or not you got better regions. So let's do let's do the helm slot first. <laughs> this is going to be All very right, obvious. Oh my god, G. I I wonder where he went. Uh, so my guy had Fremnit. <laughs> oh, no. oh no, is he going magic? It's gonna be a disaster. Oh my god, um, okay, let's... Or maybe it was the only thing I could put on my head, Link. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay. Let's go shield then, mate. Did you get one together? I don't have shields. Okay. Obviously with Fremnit and Lighthouse, yeah, okay. it, was, it, was, okay. it was a no-brainer. Mm -hmm. Yep, yep. <sighs> okay. Wow, I mean, yeah, dude, you had a lot of money, which yeah. makes me think yeah. that you probably are gonna be going melee, maybe, because you can just afford all a bunch of so I stuff actually do. That... I I thought the room Warhammer was in stock at Relica, and it's oh, not. It's a not. Yeah, it's a zero stock shop. So I was like, oh, that's sick. We're gonna have a Berserker helm and the room Warhammer, and then I was <laughs> like, oh no, it's only the Addy in there. So yeah. That, that was a bit of a... Because I thought, what a place, but no. Okay. All right. Um, all right. Let's uh, do Cape. And this will give mine away. Ooh, this will give mine away as well. Oh, my God. Oh. You had five or... I, I, I don't know what amount you got at the myth skill, but you must... Uh, you had a, you know, a bunch of rune at your disposal, a fucking dragon mm. weaponry. Oh, There's magic no. trees there. Um, but dude, I had 45k oh, for the there. legends in ranging, so I couldn't get the ranging cape. But oh, that would have been a play and a half. I know, I know. Not not a bad it. not a bad region though in terms of like unlocks because there's food cape. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I did buy swordfish mm -hmm. and um obviously i mean it's not like i'm giving anything away you yeah. would have known that but um yeah i mean dude the best bow in there is fucking willow dude really yeah so i, I was I thought freaking there'd be at out. least a like, maple in there dude i was like how the fuck do i manage my money with what arrows do i buy i'm like i could get a magic short bow in other regions but yeah. like what if i don't you know so I bought like 200 plus mithril arrows and shit, wow. and I'll just let you see how it unfolded. Okay. But <laughs> it was a fucking mess. Um, dude, I so I got Relica first, then Myth Skilled, and I bought all the tools I could and everything. But there was mm. I didn't get an axe, I didn't get a pickaxe, and so I went to the Myth Skilled without being able to get the rune I or not able to cut the trees. Ooh. Nothing. Let's go boots. All right, all right. Uh, 
pretty standard. Okay. Uh, just insulated he from had a Slayer, Slayer Master. Master. That's just from Nick too, right? Yeah, just from me. Let's go uh, gloves. Oof, okay. Okay. Um, what are leathers from the guild? Yeah. Yeah. Also from the guild. Is that from Champions Guild? Desert? I don't even know if Desert was on the list. Car I just kind of spun Caridian Desert was on the list, correct. Did you make them or some shit? Yeah. <laughs> How did you get them? Wait, I'll, I'll, I'll tell you in a minute. I think it uh, all will become clear very soon. Okay. Okay. <laughs> oh, fuck. Let's sake. go. Let's go legs. I'm just a ranging guild prodigy <laughs> at this point, man. Uh, dude, that's too much green, bro. I'm a greedy boy. I'm a greedy boy. I mean, I I think the um the the desert also sells green dehyde chaps, so that's that really why I went with the legs. So you were still a little bit between the two. Let's go body. <sighs> dude, my picks were real. Fuck. They were real. I had such a good, like, I just had money, I had areas, it was insane. Fuck, man. But I didn't have enough money to buy the rune skirt or legs in the Nada shop. And so right. I thought, doesn't really matter. If he goes magic, we got some magic defense here. So. Okay. 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 Uh, well, I just have a weapon, man. On go. Sounds good. Three, two, one, go. Oh, fuck! That's not, that has never won a PVP challenge, but if an updated, that fucking spiky ball over there. Yeah, is it's now four so. tick. It's now four tick. Uh, uh, How so did I, you get this hey, together? Uh, the second. Oh, that's a good one. one. Yeah, and there's an axe shop. Dude, I spent five minutes planning how to get an axe, and I'm like, there's a <laughs> wood cutting guild on fucking Zaya. Wow. Um, yeah. Dude, and that's the, I was stressing, bro. Let's just say in Zaya, I didn't do everything I wanted to do. Because right. it's just so fucking big, that place. Yeah. It should not be that fucking long. Wow, but... actually, that's like... I, I was looking at you before, and I was like, okay, ease win here. But that is a weapon and a half. Like, that is a top, top tier weapon. We've seen that yeah. out, outdo rune crossbows. Yeah. I, I, I even said that in the video. I said, if he doesn't have a lot of defensive bonuses, this is a better uh, upgrade than a rune crossbow. Wow. Um... I do have rune arrows because I did buy 49 of them just in case yeah. I got a wow. um, magic short bow. So that um, laid off. Range is my lowest defense other than magic, obviously, out of the lot. So it was the combat start you, again. Link, yeah. What is your magic defense? It is 15. Which I'm quite happy with. Oh, we went Slayer Dart! Oh, no, I did it. What are you... What just are you... the only staff I could get. Oh. Shall we show our inventories? Oh, my God. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> this could be interesting. <laughs> oh, with Zay, you get Archaeus, don't you? Yeah, dude. <laughs> I was oh, scrambling. Oh, no. Oh my god, okay. Do you know what? I'm happy though. I got lucky with the money, but it didn't it shows that the money didn't win this challenge. This is gonna be close. This is gonna Dude, be close. Dude, I'm stressed that the only reason you have green dehyde chaps is because you were too broke <laughs> with five hundred K. Okay, let's see the uh, food. Off camera yes. you've just told me that that staff came from Canafis. Yes. I know fucking Rufus sells raw sharks. Oh dude, this was port. Piscarillus, oh, man. Don't, don't even oh, worry yeah, about Rufy, boy. Oh my god, Zay is so OP. <laughs> so, I mean, I'm surprised oh. you didn't say, oh no, he has sharks. <sighs> I've got, I've fished them in Relica because all, all I did in Relica was buy the stuff and then it was just fish the whole time. Um, and then I actually mm. got Caridian Desert and did Tempros. I did one Tempros. I got a few swordfish from Relica oh, as shit. well, but I did one Tempros. Um, and there's, you don't get any combat XP, it was just straight up skilling. Um, and one of the drops I got from Tempros was 11 swordfish, which was pretty cool. So yeah. Wow, look at that. Old content, but new content all at the yeah. same time. What's going to win? What's going to win? <laughs> well, my freeze is hit. I mean, if my freeze is hit, I think I'm okay, but <laughs> they, they don't always hit, guys. Wow. Okay. All right, mate. Let's hop Ooh, to a PvP world. This. And let's do this.
it is my video, so you do get the first hit. All right. Um, just gonna give a little spin first quickly. for good luck. Ooh, bloody hell. Yeah. Guys, this rune chain body gives minus three magic. I know a lot of people are gonna be like, why didn't Link take his rune chain off? There's no point. There's no point. For the minus three magic, if I have that off and he hits me with a magic short bow, he's gonna cut through me. So I'm gonna I'm gonna keep it on, is the decision. Before everyone's like, why? You hit me with whatever you got, mate. Two second warning. Oh god, here we go. Here we go. Oh god, yeah. Ooh, Ooh okay. shit. Okay. Oof. Okay, he's hit. He's hit. Ooh. Oh fuck, fuck, oh. fuck. <gasps> okay. Alright, nope, that's fine. We we had to find our footing. The footing needed to, to be found. To find footing. Needed to be found. Exactly. See, this is his exactly. power play, guys. I think, oh, I think he's going to have us here, guys. I think he's going to have us here. You are tanky as fuck, though. I got to make sure I hit... Oh, yeah, this is going to be... Instantly I might have to take off. Disregarded what I said. I might have to take off... <sighs> my... Armor when I do that. Oh god, I'm just not hitting though. Oh, come on, tank, 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 tank test, tank test. I feel like I'm in the wildy and a clan's found me. <laughs> Although you're you're not running for home, <laughs> yeah. you are risking your life. I want the fight. I want the fight. Oh, oh my god. god, we're hitting hard. <gasps> I don't I don't have too many freezes, so I don't want to just send them, but God, we might have to, you guys. Uh Oh, of course he catches. Oh, wants another. Oh, he's got the bloods. Of course he does. Of course he does. Not bad. Chain oh, chains off. Actually, I, might I don't know why I did that. I'm fucking low on arrows already, guys. Not low, low, but they're all on the fucking ground, yeah, you know? Yeah, I bet that's not nice to see. <sighs> oh, no. He's actually... Ooh. You might even be just out de DPSing me here. Oh, come on. Come on, big hits, big hits, big hits. No, he can hit a 29. Come on. <gasps> We're getting a 31. Oh, we just got it. We just got it. We just got it. <sighs> Keep that augury on. Keep that augury on. Oh, no, fuck. <sighs> Lucky I ate. Couldn't get to him. Oh, we hit big when we get to him. We hit big when we get to him. Oh, catch it every time, man. Crazy. It's very hard to flick when you're maging and shit, though, at least for me. Fuck it, guys. For us We're gonna unskilled have to... players. Yeah. <laughs> Why aren't I hitting? Hit, come on. <gasps> wow. <laughs> oh my god, yes. Oh my I god, hit every time. <laughs> He's picking up his arrows. <laughs> I have to. Don't roast me. I legit can't afford not to pick him up. It's embarrassing. Bang. Oh god. Put him down, put him down, put him down, put him down. We need to hit catch so it, hard. Catch here. it, catch it, catch it, catch don't the catch freeze. It, Come on. It, don't catch it. Don't catch it. Ah I'm low on runes, guys. I have to be very conservative now on runes. <laughs> this is like for the premise of the video, this has become way more strategic than I ever thought it was going to. Dude, my range just doesn't hit. Yeah, it's it's bad, isn't it? What the fuck? And you hit me. Uh, come on. Oh no. Come on, come on. Oh come on, thank you, thank you, thank you. <sighs> Are you joking? Are you joking? <sighs> Thought I hadn't been recording for a sec there, B's and G's. <laughs> I was like, <laughs> this has been an panic. epic fight. <laughs> <laughs> no. I don't know where, which way this is going. I have no idea, mate. Oh my god. <gasps> oh, oh! I could have killed you there. We could have done it. We could have done it. I have to go through. I need the arrows. I'm focusing it's so bad, much on prayer I... flicking that I didn't have the chance to hit you. 
I'm wasting all my frozen time eating instead of putting fucking damage onto you. I'm gonna risk it. Oh no. Go, 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 go. Come on. And a we one. Splash. Oh my god, is he out? Is he out of runes? That's the question here. I do have piety on my quick press. Yeah, I do. Nice. Oh, still got that off. Idiot. Idiot. Oh, 35 spec. I'm out. Oh. Oh. My range didn't hit. Yeah, my range dude. just would I'm not so hit. I'm so surprised by that. Because I'm only like 125 range defense. How much food? Six sharks. Oh, yeah, that wasn't even fucking close. Wow. The last like minute, I didn't have any more flicks left because yeah. it was very hard to take off my armor, put on the prayer, and then attack you, and then turning off the prayer really quick. <sighs> Plus, whenever you were just getting those massive hits yeah. with me, I kept it in because I every time I froze you, I would spend my time eating. <laughs> the issue is when I throw a 33 at you, you have to eat. You can't go for the freeze. I made that mistake in a few videos ago with the uh, with the. It's not uh, even the magic that let me down here, dude. The range just yeah, didn't hit. The range. These are G's. If you enjoyed that, what it is. there's another one on Rog's channel on Thursday. Uh, another solo, yes. just a fun video. We come up with another cool idea that I think is going to be awesome. It's going to be it's going to be such a good video. So if you do want to watch that, if it's Thursday right now, the link will be in the description. If not, if you're here a bit early, uh, there will just be a link to Rog's channel. So you know, subscribe, click the bell, and all that, so you don't miss it. And uh, hopefully, if the house move all goes well and all that good stuff, then uh, the mini series starts next week, and it is going to be something completely different, guys. There's going to be all sorts of things: weapons, armors, NPCs, actions that you guys have never seen us do, let alone probably anyone. It's going to be really interesting. Kins, mate, I'll let you outro us. Uh, don't nerf range, guys, because range obviously <laughs> sucks again. So. Jagex, I don't know what you're doing with this whole range nerf shit. Um, yeah, about it. See you in the next one. See you later, guys.